Hey guys, a quick and unexpected bulletin for you. Japan's little lunar lander that could has done it again. According to JAX's latest posting on X, quote, last night we received a response from Slim confirming that the spacecraft made it through the lunar night for a second time. Since the sun was still high and the equipment was still hot, we only took some shots of the usual scenery with the navigation camera and you're looking at that shot right now. A new shot from the surface of the moon from a spacecraft that shouldn't have been able to survive one night on the moon, let alone two long and ridiculously cold lunar nights. JAXA goes on to say, quote, according to the acquired data, some temperature sensors and unused battery cells are starting to malfunction, but the majority of functions that survived the first lunar night were maintained even after the second lunar or night. Amazingly, this spacecraft, for the most part, appears to still be operational. An amazing accomplishment for JAXA, way above and beyond what was anticipated. At first, this spacecraft, as we all know, had fallen over on its face during a bit of a troubled landing, one that was very precise in terms of its location, but on a slope that put it over onto its nose. However, the equipment on the spacecraft and its two micro rovers were still operational and the mission was completed as planned. Thus far, out of all of the recent landings on the lunar surface, the JAXA Slim is the only one to survive the lunar night, at least in the 21st century. An amazing accomplishment for such a humble and small lunar lander, and I think that the rest of the space agencies on the planet could learn a lot from JAXA and this little lunar lander that could. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, please subscribe, and as always, stay angry about space.